What's up everybody, it's Warren, and thanks for stopping by the channel today. We have a lot of hype right now about Black Widow. The trailer is expected to be here within a week. Recent reports say that the trailer is expected to be here either December 2nd or December 3rd. So if that ends up being true, then we can expect the trailer a week from today. But to hold you off until then, we have reports of a leaked trailer description by somebody who has seen the actual trailer. Now, this is kind of likely because the trailer is supposed to be here within a week, which means some people have probably seen it already. And this leak comes from the Instagram account MCU underscore India, and then it was posted on credit, but MCU India is the original poster. So I'm going to break down and go over this leak, but if you would like to see the Black Widow trailer unspoiled, I suggest clicking away now. Also, be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on the MCU and for your chance to win an Xbox One or a PS4. More about the giveaway at the end. So here are some of the details shared about the first Black Widow trailer that should be coming soon by MCU underscore India. The trailer's first dialogue will be the one from Avengers Endgame, which was present in the San Diego Comic-Con trailer as well. While washing her face, Natasha says, I used to have nothing, then I got this job, this family, I was better because of it. I've made mistakes, I can't go back. Now, of course, this is the dialogue from Avengers Endgame where Natasha is talking to Steve Rogers. Now, it would make sense that the trailer would open up with this dialogue because she died in Avengers Endgame. This is, of course, a Black Widow prequel in case anybody didn't know that. It's taking place after the events of Civil War and before the events of Avengers Infinity War. So again, it makes sense that they would open with that dialogue. Then the dialogue continues as the footage shows some flashback scenes from previous MCU movies that show some of the Avengers, Nick Fury, and others. This also makes sense for the trailer. Now, this makes sense too because Marvel actually did this with Avengers Endgame. They showed clips of previous movies in the MCU before showing new footage of the movie. So we'll get some old dialogue and then we'll get some flashbacks as well. But then, we see Natasha on a mission where she met a Russian agent, aka Yelena Belova, and calls her sister, where both of them point guns at one another and then they fight each other. The fight ends as they both pass out. Now, this lines up with everything that we know so far. We know that Yelena Belova is going to be in the movie. We know that she calls her sister. And if I'm not mistaken, some people have claimed to have seen this footage of Yelena and Natasha fighting. So, all lining up so far. But then, the next shot reveals the family reunion, as this leak calls it, of Natasha Romanoff with her sister figure, Yelena Belova, father figure, Alexei Shostakov, aka Red Guardian, and a long beard wearing a red suit, and a mother figure, Melina Vostikov. And the leak says that this could be Red Guardian's wife. But in this scene, there are jokes regarding someone's weight and being so fat that the old suit might not fit them. Now, this joke is most likely made at Red Guardian's expense, who of course is going to be played by David Arbor. He's most likely donning the Red Guardian suit for the first time in a very long time, and he's probably packed on a few pounds since then. Then again, it could just be the sisters poking fun at one another, but unfortunately, we'll have to wait another week to find out. But it is nice to know that in a movie that could be very, very serious, there is going to be some humor in it. But the leak goes on to say that also there's somebody else's voiceover present in the footage but the source is confused and isn't 100% sure of whether or not it's Nick Fury's voice or somebody else's. The source says most of the things have been blurred out apart from the characters faces and their voices due to some security reasons. Which makes sense they don't want some things about the trailer to get out which apparently they already did so sorry Marvel. But that's it for the trailer except for the fact that the source mentions that the trailer is exactly 2 minutes long. Now, keep in mind that this is a teaser trailer. They're not going to really go full into depth on what we can expect from the movie. It seems like part of it is going to be old footage and old dialogue mixed with new scenes that we can see in the movie. But it seems very believable to me, and like I said, the trailer is expected within the next couple of weeks, so it makes sense that people have seen it. And if somebody has seen a trailer, it's sure to be leaked. Now, one thing to note is that there's no mention of Taskmaster at all with this trailer. Now, recently there's been a supposed leak that says Taskmaster isn't really the main villain. So that could possibly be the reason why Taskmaster was not mentioned in this trailer. And perhaps they're trying to keep the true nature of the main villain a secret. After all, it is a movie about master assassins and spies. But if this is what we get for the first teaser trailer, let me know, are you happy with this? And be sure to comment down below if you are excited about Black Widow and the start of phase four. Like the video if you enjoyed it, and as I mentioned, be sure to subscribe to my channel to stay up to date on Marvel content, and so you can enter my giveaway for a chance to win an Xbox One or a PS4. I'm picking a winner at 550,000 subscribers. I'm also doing an Infinity Gauntlet giveaway. You can follow me on Twitter to enter and click the link in the description down below as well. As always, thank you all so much for watching. 
Woof, woof.